Harvesting rainwater from rooftops is the easiest thing that we can do. Typically, rooftops have what are called drain pipes bringing the rainwater down. What you need to do is to fix a small gap as a bypass arrangement to take away the dirty water whenever we clean the roof. Open this gap and the water, dirty water comes out. Close it and the water will stay in the cap, in the pipe and go all the way up there. So we capture every two millimeters of rain separately in what we call the first rain separator. And then we bring it to a filter. A filter is very easy to do and can be built in two days maximum. Here is how a filter looks like. Water coming down from the roof, charcoal, six inches of it, and below the charcoal, six inches of coarse sand. The rainwater goes through the charcoal and the sand and comes out through this pipe and goes into our sump tank. If there's very heavy rain, the water builds up in the filter and there's a bypass arrangement made. The bypass arrangement has a net to prevent leaves from going. Can we come closer and take a look at the net? So the water level rises up when it rains heavily and it goes through this net, through the bypass and back into the sump tank. I'll show you where the sump tank is. Plus the sump tank. And those are the pipes which bring the rainwater from the rooftop into this. This sump tank is 6,500 liters. The roof is 100 square meters. The rainfall in Bangalore is 970 millimeters. We are harvesting 97,000 liters of rainwater every year. Our family consumes 300 liters every day. This 97,000 liters is good enough for 320 days in a year. If the rainfall is well distributed, we are virtually self-sufficient for water from rainwater harvesting level. There are 10 lakh houses in Bangalore. If all the houses harvest rainwater, there will be no water crisis in the city. If the houses don't harvest rainwater, we will face a crisis in the coming year itself. The choice is ours. This is Wish Rainwater Club from Bangalore.